Grand Community, <coughs> good afternoon. My name remains Apostle Hanchiku. I just had a voice note from Ngwa Kachiku. And uh, I believe that voice note is not standing the test of time. One, I want to start from appealing to the government committee to please don't listen to a confused voice note. My reasons of calling Ngwaya Akachuku voice note, confused voice note, are as if I am going to stipulate on this voice note one after the other with some questions behind whatever I am saying. One, Ngwaya Akachuku is the voice note you made now telling us that the grant belongs to the wife to Bremi, Professor Bremi, which is to he brought the grant. Did you, were you aware that it was him that brought the grant before you started shouting UAAG, UAAG? One. We are you away? Secondly, before you started collecting thousands and hundreds and millions from people for the restriction of UAAG that gave you cars and house today. You came up and told us that our grand pressure group have gotten money from the government. And from all indication now, we are you not a sell out to your words after telling us that these palace boys are responsible are going to be in charge of disbursement right now you are shooting on your legs by deceiving the poor masses again with your malaria dreams secondly we are you aware that the grant we are talking about has some portions a portion to the family of Brahmi and the U.S. Ngwakachuku, I still want to ask you more questions. One, Ngwakachuku, the same money you said you supported and you led us to know that government gave to all grand pressure group to this boss, which Ken is trying to be an all circles. Is this the same money you are talking about U.S. money? Ngwakachuku, I won't advise you. You never had a dream. God can never show you his secret, even if there is any secret in what you said. As you said, uh, Admin Eli said, he, God will reveal the secret. Because you are not honest. You are not a good disciple of God, not to talk of man. You betrayed the grand community. You lured the grand community into fraud with your international community. I want to put it to you, Ngwaga Kachuku, Reverend Ngwaga Kachuku, an Assemblies of God pastor. Why are you, who which, who betray, who which haunt you? Who, 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 who held your truth in you? Who held the honest in you? Now you want to call her the wife of Brahmi into a danger zone. Because all the angles you have been exploited have not been working for you. Now the next thing you want to do is to bring up the wife of Prophet Brahmi to come and contest and begin to, let me tell you, your games have been made open. God have rejected you in the grand community. You are a froster. You duped a lot of people through this grant. A lot of NGOs paid you. You never had revelation. When you we are dealing with uh, uh, international community, making your money, calling us your friends, you never have revelations. When we are collecting hundreds and millions of money from people with the proof are on the ground, you never have connection, uh, uh, revelation. Now is the time for your revelation. Please allow that gentle and honest woman to allow her peace to reign please stop bringing her out stop bringing her out she knows the content of what that belongs to her and nobody will eat what belongs to prophet professor brahami family 
and nobody will drag it in the heaven and on the earth. It is either you allow peace to reign and you close your mouth, your leaking and stinking mouth you are using to embarrass people. This is what I have for you because you are not honest. Anybody that followed the step of your voice so we know that you are a deceiver. You are looking for a soft landing to apologize to Jehoshaphat and all that people you have made enemy of because of your kids to make wealth. Remember you were a poor man, a poor pastor before God connected you to Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama that you use the UAAG grant to make money and it was UAAG that brought you out of to the life of people to know you. You became a lord when you were robbing people and stealing from people's pocket in the name of registry. Even when UAG have not called for, call for registration, today you want to prove to the world you are a saint, you are a visioner, you are a chronic liar. You are a chronic liar. I, a, there's a, a write up or a voice note I had that say you should go for altar call for repentance. Go and repent. You are not a child of God. God can never reveal anything to you. Buy and go and work on yourself.